Hey everybody, back with a new episode of Supernatural. Last episode, we said goodbye to Henriksen. Really upset by that. He didn't make the end of the episode. He was blown up by Lilith, who is a little girl. And uh, it was explained to me that the way that Sam knew of her was more of just the generalized talks he's had with, with Ruby and not some like actual confrontation that he's had with her, which is where I went. I don't know why, but I did. But, okay, so I understand that. And also that um, it said on the TV that they were assumed dead. So they are for sure dead. Um, but Lilith, oof. Little girl, <sighs> looking for them. And very concerning. Because <laughs> what she did in like that hot second that we saw her, devastating. Um, the meat of the episode though about you know the police station and uh them being surrounded by all the demons that was really what the episode was about um and you know choices that were made versus ones that weren't um old sammy willing to sacrifice virgins so just giving us a little sneak peek of where he's at really upsetting. I'm sure that last six months that he's living with is not helping this situation, but man. Um, this next episode is called Ghost Facers. Let's get into it. Network executive. Oh my yeah. God, these dudes. Today is your lucky day, Mr. From Hell Nick. House. The unsolicited pilot you are about Hell to House, watch right? is the bold new future of reality TV. Mm, oh we God. know you've had it hard during the crippling writer's strike. Ghost, Ghost Facers. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, they... <laughs> They're in the credits. Do ghosts come from? He looks like no. Ted from Shit's Creek. Here I am. Is he? Y'all, Shit's Creek is such a good show. Oh, ow! French Vanilla. I, the other day, he said how much you liked it. So, thank you. I think he's got the hots for Ed, and that could spell trouble for the whole team. Ed's kind of the <laughs> more rugged with that really golden. Oh yeah. Definitely the hot. Beautiful sort of beard. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice setup, you dummy. <laughs> we don't need that. Look at that bear. Spin the tires like the fires. Oh, yeah, Go baby. facers on three. Do it. One, two, three. Go are y'all all gonna die? <laughs> Just ew, ew, ew. I, I don't really like rats. They're gross. Rats are like the rats of the world. What well, was that? A uh, was that an apparition? Was that a spectral? Uh... Freeze! Police officers, stop them! So them. Let's see some identification. Come on, let's see some ID. What? Are we? Are we <laughs> Give me some ideas. Oh, 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 hold on a second. I know that both of you guys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh. Holy. <laughs> what? Uh, West Texas, the, 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 the Tulpa we had to take out, those two goofballs that almost got us killed. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> okay, didn't test that well. What's going on? I love seeing them from no, like a different yeah, point yeah. of view. Something keeps messing with the chip. I don't know what's going on here. Guys. Guys, what? Guys, what? Oh. look, buddy. I'm sorry. That's it. I'm telling you, that's all the money. Hey, aren't those from Texas? <laughs> yes. I, I wish they would cuss naturally and just let them beep it. Honest to God, proof. All right. It's more realistic. Where's Corbett? I wish to communicate oh, with the Corbett. rest of the spirits here. Oh, buddy. Hey, hey, hey. Uh-oh. You good? You happy? Yeah, I am happy. Let's go hunt the morning now. You said it's our grand canyon. So you're my lawyer. You got two months left, Dana. Instead, we're gonna die tonight. Come on, what are you waiting for? Oh! Where'd they all go? What? 
Why is it an echo of being hit by a car in the house? That's weird. There's no records of any of this here. I mean, no one got shot here. Obviously, no one got run over by a freaking train. I right, seriously, just looking at this nightmare through that camera make you feel better or something? I mean... Um, I, uh... Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah, I think so. Oh. <laughs> that was a little meta. Survival under atomic attack. An optimist. <laughs> Very much an optimum. Dagger brought the remains home from the morgue to play. Ew. Ew. Oh, that's oh. nasty, dude. <laughs> Closer to the herd, okay? Maggie? Maggie? He's so cute. She's fine. Jesus Christ. Harry! Harry, I got an 8.6 and climbing fast. Something huge is coming. What? Sister Ed, Harry, Best. Ed, Harry, Ed, listen, Ed, are you banging my sister? It's like Ross. Oh my glasses. From Friends. What are you doing? See, they cuss all the time. That's realistic. <laughs> Corbin. Hey, wake up now. Corbin. Hey. Corbin. Hey. Oh, hey. My, oh my god. Right here. They're at a dead man's party. Stay with me. This is disturbing. Corbin, stay with me. Stay with me. You got it? I'm right here. Hey, stay with me. Don't. Don't. Go! Corbin! Go! Corbin! Okay, this is genuinely creepy. Poor Corbin. Corbin! He was a sweetheart. Where are you going? Guys like Daggett back then, the ones that were really scared of the roosties, they built bomb shelters. I'm guessing he's got one. Mm -hmm. I bet you it's in the basement. They want us to separate us. Hey, what? Listen to me. There's some salt in my duffel. Make a circle and get inside. Let's do it. Don't question. Is that your duffel bag? In the salt! You idiot! Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Get in the circle, get in the circle. In the Come on, quick, quick, quick. <laughs> it's totally okay if you uh, do my sister. Oh, oh Corbin. Oh, buddy. <laughs> hey, earlier, you and Sam, you said you had two months left? Yeah, it's complicated. A while ago, Sam. <laughs> no, 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 no. I'm not gonna whine about my problems to some reality show. I'm gonna do my job. I love it so much. Is it cancer? Shut up. <laughs> that is disturbing. Oh no, Corbett. No tact. Corbett. This is very sweet of him. Okay, I'm not gonna hurt you. Listen. I don't know if it's gonna go Listen. terribly or not. Okay. Though. Corbin. He had feelings for you. Don't do huh? this. He wanted you. What? What did he oh want? Oh my god. No. He meant a lot to me. Aww. You know, never, never back down. Never say a bad word. Okay, I remember that, Corbin. I, I, I remember that. I remember that because I love you, Corbin. Do you remember that? Do you? Hey. Ed? Yeah. You all right? You feel queer, baby? Guys. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come through, Corbett. <laughs> I guess. Hey, oh my God. We learn more than we can <laughs> say in the brutal feet of the Morton House. 
far as we're concerned, you're not an intern anymore. You have more than earned full ghost facer status. All this time you were teaching us about hard, about dedication, and about how gay love can pierce through the veil of death and save the day. If, are Thank you, you Alan J. Corbin? Go well <laughs> to that starry night. It's ridiculous. Young Turk. I think all our dreams are gonna come true. Does that sound stupid? Time to die, yeah. <laughs> Aww. Corbett. King of the Impossible. You are ridiculous. Why? <laughs> can't believe they showed it to him. You know, I kind of think it was half awesome. Half that's only half good, right? Yeah, I mean, it's it's bizarre how y'all are able to uh, to honor Corbett's memory while grossly exploiting the manner of his death. Well done. What did yeah. he just do? Yeah, that's a real tight rope you guys are walking. Yeah. Did right, he guys. take the flash drive? Uh. Whoa. Uh. What is this? <laughs> uh, I seem to be having some technical difficulties. Yeah, you're all here. fucked. <laughs> That is money in the bank. <laughs> well, they committed to the bit, you know. They really did just about the entire episode as, you know, found footage type shots. And I enjoyed that. Like, I, Emily, my friend who does the X-Files reactions with me, we always watch just all the horror movies we can. And we've seen a ton that have that kind of setup where it's people looking for ghosts and like a haunted place and everyone dies but it is a bummer that the only gay character died and it was played for laughs and I do feel queer baited because I, I would have appreciated it more if he actually really did have feelings for Corbett and that were well, like awoken in him it would have been tragic but that was ridiculous <laughs> ridiculous I'm almost positive that was Ted from Schitt's Creek, um, but he was great. I really liked Corbett a lot and bummed that he died. But like I said, like I do like to see the the Sam and Dean in, in like at their work from like a different perspective. Of course, they would like be Dean would be cousin of a storm. I know it. So I love that. That seemed very true to life. And you know, if only they weren't on the CW, they could do that. But I appreciate that they they showed that as like a real world look at it. The the premise of the of the actual ghost house was interesting. It was very creepy. The dude like using dead bodies to go to his party. How sad. Um, he but it really made it seem like he's you know been this loner guy since the Cold War, and you know was also a fucking creep. <laughs> So that worked. That was that was you know it makes sense for a a, a haunted house situation. Um, it was great to see the ghost facers, <laughs> idiots <laughs> again. Like I love that continuity. If they keep showing up every once in a while, I'm sure that will be like a fun like running gag. That it definitely seems like they were having you know fun. This one, there's only three episodes left, so I I'm definitely for sure that this is the last like silly on its own type episode. Um, so glad to have one more of those until we get into the last bit because I'm, you know, two months they said, two months. What is gonna happen? I don't know. Um, but yeah, this was, it was fun. I didn't love the gay fake out storyline thing. Not great, but overall like i appreciated what they did i you know it i did laugh a lot and um yeah it's a a little fun little conceptual little episode so i appreciate that so um until next time thanks for watching guys i'll be back soon